Howdy folks, it's been a while since I've shared a cocktail with you, so I just want to dive in with my go-to cocktail right now. It's the Howler Head Whiskey Sour. Now I'm based out on the East Coast, so before I flew out West, I hadn't even seen this bottle. I'm not sure it's available for us on the East, but when I saw it, the imagery completely drew me in. And so I Googled it and saw that a lot of people loved it and figured since the price point was right, I'd buy it and see what I thought. Um, it's a banana flavored whiskey, and I love it because the banana flavor isn't over overly powerful. I typically do not like flavored whiskey, um, and I have only used this one in a cocktail. I think I tasted it straight or neat um, the first time I got it just to do it, um, but it is amazing in cocktails. The banana is very subtle, and so it doesn't overpower it, but in this whiskey sour, it's an absolute winner. And so in my shaker, I already have um, some egg whites, or one egg white, excuse me, and then we're gonna take an ounce and a half of uh, Howler Head, momentarily forgot, dump that in there. We're gonna take a half ounce of simple syrup and we're gonna take three fourths ounce of lime juice and lemon juice. I don't know if this was new to you all, but I have never seen um, a whiskey sour that uses both lemon and lime. So when I first saw that Howler Head put that in their recipe, it piqued my interest. Um, and then we're gonna do two dashes of bitters Run a little low, so that was three shakes, but it's because like they were like the last drops. All right, got a little ice here. I already chilled this glass, but um, just I didn't know how long I was gonna talk. Just added some cubes there, excuse the noise. All right, and you will see, I know some, some bartenders joke that I was being a punk for using uh, a towel with my shaker, but now I've elevated to the elevator shaker and I don't need one. My little workout on. I'm trying to work the sweat. I should have turned the heat off before I started these videos. But you live and you learn. And it has a strainer in the top. I mean, just look at that. As soon as I say it, it starts like coming out all weird. But <laughs> I can hear the foam. I love it every drop. All right, I won't bore you all with. All right, I'll get the rest later. But as you can see, the egg whites made it nice and foamy. Oh. And because I've been working out and I'm just so strong, there's like chunks of ice in it. Oh, so delicious. Like the little tiny chunks, not like annoying chunks of ice. But yeah, perfectly balanced not too acidic, the banana flavor is there, but in the background. So this is now my go-to whiskey sour. When I have people over to my home, this is usually the first cocktail I make for them. And so I would highly suggest you make it for yourself and your loved ones. Feels good to be back. I hope you all are well, and I hope the rest of your week goes well. Cheers, folks.